Well, for people who love snow, the weather in the five boroughs was kind of a letdown with just over three inches reported in Central Park. Still, that said, it's still mm -hmm. the most snow we've seen in a while, and people made the most out of it. Kendall Green live in Inwood with more on how New Yorkers spent the snow day. Kendall. <laughs> Yeah, hey, good evening, Stephen Natasha. This snowstorm came just a day ahead of Valentine's Day. And staying in that same spirit, it's safe to say New Yorkers have a love hate relationship with the snow. We talked to some folks who were clearly on cloud nine with it, others so frustrated they were quite literally ready to skip town. The shovels and snow plows are back to work again in the Big Apple for the first time in a while. Plenty of New York sidewalks tucked away in a blanket of snow, ready for cleanup after 2024's first winter storm. While Bronx residents didn't necessarily roll out the welcome wagon. It wasn't that bad last winter. This winter, I, I was really shocked to see all the snow outside it, and sticking. It's too cold. Been here too long. All my life. It's just snow, snow, snow. Hey, you're looking for something else <laughs> somewhere yeah, else. Yeah, we need some heat over here. Joshua Roman here has his hands full lugging 20 and 15 pound bags ready to catch the four train to the airport heading for more pleasant weather he hopes in texas so you'd leave in just to get to some warm weather basically Facts, absolutely if you think this is a, a a good fun thing you're wrong it's cold it's annoying it's bad it hurts give it your best one go on but the snow wasn't met with nearly as much hostility for the young folks we're gonna go play in the snow and make a snowman and they did. We actually followed them to the park for a good time on the other side of the storm. While they played, the MTA and city's Department of Sanitation was busy at work with hundreds of plows and salt trucks clearing the slushy sidewalks and keeping the tracks and switches clear from any extra ice for trains carrying loads of New Yorkers on the move. Now, so far, crews are making good progress on the cleanup, while some are pretty relieved about it. Others are, dare I say, hoping for more snow the next time. And in Inwood, Kendall Green, Fox Mountain News. Still early in mm -hmm. winter. All right, thanks, Kendall. Well